today. I'm gonna be unboxing the Rainbow High Winter Break Jade doll. I snagged her off Walmart. I haven't even opened the box yet. And that's what we're gonna be doing. I'm gonna be reacting to it and unboxing it. So, here we go. I do have the Winter Break Poppy coming still. I actually ordered that one first, but for some reason, this one came first. Eee, I'm so excited. <gasps> wow. For some reason, I didn't even picture, like, the snowboard being that big. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So, also, just look at the back packaging. I really want to just frame that. That is so, it's, it's so pretty. So yeah, let's take everything out of here. I'm so excited. Oh, that came out a lot easier than the originals. I would love it if this packaging was easier to open than the originals. I've opened three other Rainbow High dolls so far. This would be my fourth one that I opened. I have the first Amaya with the rainbow hair. And I have a Poppy. And Kiwi has Skylar. I don't know what it is, but for some reason I just don't really like Skylar that much. At least the original one. I do plan on getting every single one of the winter break ones. Actually, these little tiny scissors. I just love this packaging too with um, the frosted parts on it. I don't know if you can see that with all my lights. So here are the skates. I love that the skates have the slit in the back so that it's easy to get them in. I saw people complaining that the skates were not actual metal but this is a children's toy. Like these are made for children. A lot of adults do collect them, but these are made for children. They are in the toy section. They're not in the collectible section at Walmart and Target. They're not by the Funko Pops or, you know, whatever. Yeah, they're plastic. Here's the coat. This is such a cute little coat. I just love this. You can see there it says rainbow and the little green details on the collar. The little fur details and then the faux leather that is so adorable and then here's the shirt and the skirt love and i don't know what like outfit i'm gonna display her in yet like i really do love the ski suit but I love that stuff too, so I'm gonna have to just play around with it and see, you know. Whoa! Here's the stand and hangers. Those hangers are so cute. These hangers are different than the other ones. These ones actually say rainbow on it. I just think that's so cute. And here's the other little hanger with the clips. These ones seem like harder to open. That's weird. And here's the stand. Sparkly green stand. Love it. get to do all this stuff. I wonder if it would just be easier for me to just 
use my knife and just slit it there like that. She's free! Oh, my so staticky in here. The back of her hair doesn't have any gel on it and it feels so nice. I don't know why they do the gel. It's odd to me. Yeah, and then it leaves that little kink there from the bands. I don't really like that. And I don't know if this hat is like it's like permanently attached to her head. There's these little things you have to cut off. Impossible to cut these little things off without cutting the doll. Or the doll's hair. They really had to put four of these little things on her head to secure this hat. They couldn't just like put one in the front and one in the back. Oh, I lied. Five. Well, I'm like, they have the hood, but how are, how would you get the hood on? <laughs> Is that even, like, possible with this doll? I feel like not. I feel like the hood is too small for the thing's head, practically. <laughs> That's okay, though. At least it has a hood. I love how soft the back of her hair is. I think my other dolls just had the gel throughout which is kind of odd um but i love her makeup too and her side part i don't even know like how to get the gel out actually i don't know it's just kind of weird that they do the gel i could see the gel on the top but why do you have to put it all the way down throughout the bottom like you, you would want the doll to be pretty out of the package but it just looks weird like that. You know what I mean? So we're gonna have to do something about that. <laughs> but it's okay. I love her makeup and um, her face does have like some like shimmer on it. Not just on the eyes but like on her whole face. I know some people didn't really like that but I actually do like it. I think it's really pretty. It's like purple and pink shimmer on her face. I don't know if you can see that. And again, just listen. That's, I don't know why they do that. Somebody's going to tell them to stop doing that. I like that the coat is easy to take off. It's not too tight, the, you know, openings are not too tight so far it seems. I find if you put the arms back, it's way easier to take the coat off. Yeah, that coat came right off. Way easier than Poppy's freaking coat, oh my god. But anyway, here's the little coat. I want this coat for myself. It's so cute. Even this little pocket details right there on the chest, the tightening things, I love it, very cute. Um, I like this shirt that she's got on underneath it, I'm trying to see if that, it is a crop top. A lot of the shirts that they have are crop tops, which is fine, I feel like they should have some more that are not cropped. There's a couple little stringies that I'm cutting off here. Makes me sad that like the zippers don't actually work, but I mean, that would be a lot. These are so cute. Even the pockets on the, just so much detail with everything. Look close. Her arms. And I 
I love that her nails are painted green. I think on um, some of my other dolls, I'll probably paint their nails because I like it a lot more when they're painted. And then the pants. Yeah, just super cute. And then the boot. I really like this boot. I definitely like the boot more than the skates. But on the skates, it's kind of cool because the shoes are plastic, but the back of it has so much detail that it looks like it's fabric. Like, you know what I mean? It's so cool. Um, and then the hat. This is such a cute little hat. Whenever I get my, like, regular Jade doll, I probably won't keep the hat on her, but I think for the winter one, I will keep the hat on her. Because I really like this hat, it's so cute. Now is it not going to stay on that I took those things off? Wow. That is so awesome. Now other people are complaining that there's a scratch. I don't have any scratches on mine. I, wow. Okay, so this is pretty big, like, it fits in both my hands. I have pretty big hands, you guys. Um, here it is up close. I love that dripping Rainbow High logos in the pattern and in the back. I love that so much. Oh my gosh. Eee. See how easy that is. Oh, the hat is off. Everyone, hats off. Hats off. I'll probably have to... I don't even know how I'm going to get that hat off. But regardless, I would have had to take the hat off to get that gel out. So it seems like that's pretty hard to actually put her feet in there. So I'm not going to keep struggling. But I think I will have her on her stand. And then, you know, holding the board next to her or something. So I'm happy with this purchase. If you guys have any Rainbow High dolls, I would love to know which ones you have, which one is your favorite. If you are interested in seeing all of the other Winter Break dolls, I would love to unbox and react to those. I really enjoyed doing this one. This is my like first ever actual like toy video and I actually like doing it. So yeah, we will see where this takes us. So I'm going to end it here and I will see you guys next time. Bye!